Another SSD unboxing. Yes. Yes, it is. However, there is a very good reason for it. This is the OCZ Vertex. Okay, you've heard this before. But wait, there's more. Limited edition. Okay, so this is a limited edition drive. It is a 200 gigabyte drive that I'm going to be unboxing today, which seems like an odd, odd number for, for an SSD because typically what we've seen in the past is 32 gig, 64 gig, 128, 250, etc., etc. But no, this is a 200 gig. It is a high performance design with NLC flash memory. I'll more on this in a minute. Trim support and RAID capability. But let's go back to the back of this drive. Okay, latest groundbreaking solid state taking shape in the limited edition okay you can probably read that if you pause it so I'll let you do that if you want to this is where this drive separates itself from the crowd reads up to 270 megabytes per second totally unexceptional right up to 250 megabytes per second. We have not seen an MLC flash drive capable of anywhere near this kind of a write speed with sustained writes up to 235 megabytes per second. So that means that there's a little bit of a trick. This is not another Indolinx-based OCZ Vertex drive. This is based on an entirely new controller called the... If I could get the package off. I'm actually not sure if I'm allowed to say exactly what it is, but I'll say that it's made by a different vendor, one that we've been eagerly anticipating the controllers from. And it, the initials are S and F, okay? So if you, if you know too much about SSDs, in fact, you can probably Google it. All right, let's get this thing open here. But the way that they achieve this high level of write performance is through a compression algorithm that actually writes far less than you're actually telling it to. Now, that means that the controller on this drive is far more complicated than an Indolinx controller, but it is able to achieve a high level of performance without expensive flash, so it's a bit of a trade-off. Okay, so it comes with an installation guide, uh, how to prepare your drive before use, more installation guide, formatting, and your limited warranty, which I believe is three years on this drive, but it looks like it doesn't say that here. I must say it's somewhere. Yeah, there it is. Three-year warranty on this particular OCZ product. So the Vertex Limited Edition, actually, you know what? I'm going to do something unprecedented, and I'm just going to kind of put this down, and I'm going to let the cameraman look at it for a second, and I'm going to step out of the room and go get another prop. One moment. I'll be back. Yeah, I hope that was really interesting. I'm back. Just closing the door. I wanted to compare it to the older Vertex. Okay, so there we go. Basically, it looks almost the same. You can see that the label is slightly shinier because Vertex is now shiny and limited edition is shiny. They're both SATA 2, so that means that we're not going to be moving beyond the approximately 270 megabyte per second overall bandwidth limitation of a SATA 2 controller. They're the same thickness, so that means they're going to be compatible with pretty much 99% of laptops out there. They feature mounting holes on the sides as well as on the bottoms of the drives. The bottoms of these drives actually look uh, pretty much exactly the same. You can see the part number is slightly different. This is a VTX LE, whereas the older ones are just VTX. And I think that's pretty much all there is to say about it. The Vertex LE comes at a price premium. You can see that we've got a SATA 2 interface here, SATA 2 power, SATA 2 data, but you are getting the fastest MLC performance on the market today, and that is why this is worth unboxing, even though we're just looking at another black SSD drive from OCZ. Thank you for checking out my video blog.